are honored and the family picture are as fresh as ever. Well, I had access to two solutions. Mm. Every man among Colonel or Captain is deep in the militia. Odds, bales, and barrels, say no more. I'm braced for it. <laughs> the thunder of your words has soured the milk of human time within my heart. So, as a man in a the place there, I can get in such I can drink my blood. Come, come, there must be no passion in the case. These things should always be done civilly. I must be in a passion, Solution. I must be in a rage. Oh, you, Solution, <coughs> let me be in a rage if you love me. <laughs> come now, here's pen and paper. Oh, I would that these were wet. Oh, in night, I say, in night. Come now, how shall I begin? Shall I begin with an L? Oh, good Solution, sir. Oh, do the thing decently, and like a Christian. Begin now, uh, sir. Ah, oh, well, that's too civil by air. Please, sir. Yeah, but I will be next to you. 
So Lucius has brought him to it. And now fights Beverly this evening. There's so much good passion in the end of the world. What have I to do with this? Well, if I think you know something of this fellow, I shall find him out for me and give him this mortal to fight. Well, give it me and trust me that he gets it. Oh, thank you, my dear. My dear Jack. Oh, but that gives me a great deal. Oh, no, 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 Think nothing of it, Bob. Think nothing of it. You're very kind. You couldn't be my second, could you, Jack? <laughs> <laughs> well, not in this affair, Bob. It wouldn't be quite so proper. Oh, uh, then I must send for my friend, for Lucius. I shall have your good wishes, however, Jack. Whenever he needs you, believe me. Well, my uh, little hero, some success attend you. I say, 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 Jack. Is Beverly here? Oh, yes, 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 if Beverly should ask you uh, what kind of a man your friend Acus is, uh, <laughs> do tell him I'm a devil of a fellow, so you can. I'll say you're a determined dog, you know. Do you, do you. And if that frightens him again, perhaps you may come. So tell him I generally kill a man I want to I'll see you going to the country fighting well. No, I fight, fight. Just all to prevent mischief. Well, I don't want to take this life if I clear my arm. Well, you don't wish me to kill him, do you, Jack? No, on my soul, I did not. What a devil of a fellow, eh? But come on. Hey, say, say, Jack. You may ask that you never saw me in such a rage before. I will. A most devouring rage. I will. Oh. Remember, Jack, a determined dog. I like fighting Bob. Boy. Tell him I kill a man a week. I will. Tell him I kill a man a day. I will. I say, Jack. Thank you. 
You can touch the back of it. But if I'm not using by force, he can give me the stick. Oh, sir, Anthony, you have infinite trouble with this affair. I'm ashamed for the cause of it. Then, if you run, I will teach you to your respect. Oh, Miss <laughs> well, Maricroft, I hope that this young lady has reflected on the work of this gentleman and the regard to her aunt's choice and my alliance. Now, Jerry, I will speak with you tomorrow.
disinterest is known, which he now hopes to enjoy in a more elevated character. So, there is to be no elopement possible. <laughs> <laughs> Upon my word, thou art a truly impudent fellow. Quack. To do your justice, I think I never saw a beast of more concerned assurance. <laughs>
to have resentful blood that would have checked the ardor of my flame. All that was all over indeed. There are rather The copy is not equal to you, but in my mind it merits over the original, and being still the same is such that I will. Oh! <laughs> 